So good evening to you all. I am back in uh, Bodhivana Monastery in Melbourne. It's officially winter, so uh, it's cold outside. Maybe not in other parts of the world, but it is here. But a good way to face the cold is do a bit of meditation. So we'll begin with uh, 15 minutes of quiet meditation. So bring your attention to the feeling of the in-breath and the out-breath at the tip of your nostrils. Relax your body, but stay alert. There's three qualities where cultivating as we practice mindfulness of breathing. That's mindfulness itself, keeping the breath in mind, paying attention to it, remembering it. And there's all round awareness, sampajanya, or clear comprehension of what you're doing. And then atapi means ardency or sincerely devoted to it, to the practice of meditation at this time, willing to learn from it, and ardent. So we say ardent, fully aware and mindful. So that means dropping everything else as we put attention on the breath. Literally nothing else matters at this moment. You can afford to, you can allow yourself to let go of everything else. Bring all your attention to that feeling of the breath going in, breath going out. Fully understanding what you're doing and why. You're training your mind to pay attention, to bring up mindfulness, to know the breath. The breath itself is just the air element. So it's not a person, a being, me or you. Something very neutral, impersonal. It's just the breath. But the quality you're aiming for is sati, sampajanya mindful, fully aware, and then ardent with effort and sincere in your wish to train your mind to bring up wisdom, understanding that will free your mind from suffering. And we have the best teacher the world has known, the Buddha, So we take on trust the Buddha's instructions to mindfully pay attention to the breath. And we summon up our own effort and energy to overcome the hindrances that will steal away your attention to other things at this time. So the five hindrances are like thieves that take your attention away from the breath to different objects of desire, or irritation, dullness, sleepiness, worry, agitation or doubt. So we have to stay 
ardent, fully aware and mindful. So the hindrances can't steal our attention away from the present moment. And we need patience, patient effort. Even if your mind is screaming at you that you want to do something else or think about something else, just watch it patiently, don't give in. Keep returning to the breath and letting go of whatever the mind is bringing up. Even if you have some pain, try to sit comfortably, but then let go. Don't bother about the pain. It's just a feeling arising into your consciousness and then passing away. Try to brighten the mind by bringing up mindfulness and effort. As you pay attention to the breath more and more, the mind will brighten and become more interested in the breath and feel more at ease as it lets go.